Okay, so this is the package. It's a Warrior uh, MB01, well, uh, sniper rifle that's been delivered from Gunfire in Poland. Took four days to get here. Let's see uh, if it survived the journey. The packaging is very good anyway. Here we've got some accessories, uh, uh, a sight, a red dot sight. Side a receipt. When you get these packages, this one seems to be in perfect condition. You need to check that it's delivered without any damage. So uh, if it's damaged, you have to return it. Uh, this is the actual. Box the guns in. Turn it over. Here we go. MB01. This was uh, 60 euros in the sale. 65 euros. And if we come in. We have some pellets which apparently aren't very good. We've got a strap which apparently isn't wonderful. We've got a speed loader, an Allen key, and the rifle right itself comes in two parts. <laughs> or it did. <laughs> this is the, the barrel and uh, mechanism. And this is the stock, which is, this is all metal, and uh, this is ABS plastic, and it feels, it feels sturdy, it feels like it could take some abuse. So it comes with a, an instruction manual which has some graphics on, it's in Chinese and in English, but it's actually reasonably simple to put together. You need the big spanner that comes with a gun, and there's a, a bolt, uh, which you reach here. Another bolt and bolt you reach here. And these have to, these basically screw in here and here. So you have to put the the gun assembly together without. Uh, and then tighten that bolt up. That's done. And so I eventually managed to get that in. It's not too bad, and it's got a few turns to tighten it. Uh, so that's good. That's solid. You've got a chin rest here, and uh, the back rest. You can you seem to be able to take some spacings out to shorten the gun a little bit to adjust. It seems to be okay for me, so I'll tighten those up. The chin rest is hard ABS, so it's not the most comfortable of chin rests, although you could probably stick something on there if you wanted to. So take that there. And that's pretty much the gun ready to go. So here we're looking inside the magazine. The, at the front there, there's a little Allen bolt, which is the hop up. Uh, and then this is where the magazine comes. And then, as you can still see inside there, you can see, draw that back and Head it goes up there, when you fire that is released, which fires up and it's out the front. The hop up's just a little rubber thing that points up into the barrel and uh, the pellet comes past and it just puts some spin on the pellet and it governs whether the pellet will uh, fly straight, whether it will drop, go up high or go straight. So you need to play around with that for aiming, so we'll do that later. Just some, if I turn the light off, just some other points. On the front here you've got um, strap, two strap holders, and on the back you've got the same thing. So you could actually have a double strap and uh, use this a bit like a biathlon gun. Um, that's pretty much it really, it's pretty simple. So this is the magazine, we'll load this up, 
And we'll do some test shots. Here's a magazine. Good thing. Uh, that just clips in there. Pretty simple. And uh, we're ready to ready to go. Won't fly it inside because it is actually for uh, airsoft. It's fairly powerful. We've got the rail on top, and we can put the sight on that. And uh, what we're we're not doing any serious sniping. We've just got a red dot sight that we're going to use. Thank you. 